Can you just stretch your hands forward? We appreciate you, Lord, for the gift of life. We thank you for the month of January. We thank you for the month of March, February, March, April, May, and this is June. We are grateful, Lord, for your hand upon our lives. Heavenly Father, we hand our lives over to you. This month of June, we declare the blessings of the Lord upon our lives in the name of Jesus. We decree the blessings of the Lord rest upon us and our families in the name of Jesus. This season of your life, this month of June, I pray for somebody today. It's your month of divine visitation. It's your month of divine visitation. You remember what the Bible says in verse 26 of Luke chapter 1 that the angel Gabriel was sent from God into the city of Galilee to a virgin that was a divine visitation and when there's a divine visitation something different something great something amazing will begin to happen and I pray this prayer for you again that this month of June receive an amazing and a divine visitation from the Lord in the name of Jesus God will begin to touch every area of your life God will visit every aspect of your life in the name of Jesus in 1 Corinthians chapter 2 verse 9 scripture says I had not seen nor he has heard neither has it entered the heart of men what the Lord the things which the Lord had prepared for them that love him get ready this month of June you will begin to enjoy uncommon favor you begin to enjoy uncommon favor I don't know who I am speaking to but the Lord just kept whispering to me that this month of June you enjoy uncommon favor you will enjoy speed on every side the peace of God that passes all understanding rest upon you joy unspeakable joy overflowing in the name of Jesus Christ this month of June I see bodies lifted I see bodies lifted. I see bodies lifted. In the name of Jesus Christ. The angels of the Lord encamp around about them that fear the Lord and to deliver them. This month of June, you will enjoy divine preservation like never before. Your going out is blessed. Your coming in is blessed. I declare this upon your life. Your going out is blessed. Your coming in is blessed. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will keep you. The Lord will preserve you. In Jesus' mighty name. Our Father, we thank you for the gift of life. Thank you because six is the number of man. Give everyone the helper that will give them rest. Psalm 17, 14 says, Men are the hands of God. This sixth month, may God extend his hand on you by sending a good man into your life. In Ezekiel chapter 8, verse 1, says, The sixth month, the hand of God was upon me. This sixth month, may you enjoy the hand of God. In Haggai chapter 1, verse 1, he says, And the sixth month, the word of the Lord came to me. This month, you will hear God. 
in Luke 136, he said the six months that is she that was called barren. These six months, may God change your identity. I pray for you today as adamant is harder than flint. So your forehead shall be harder than that of your enemies. You become an impossible puzzle for your enemy to solve. A hard knot for them to crack. You are fortified. Heavily and heavenly guarded. Uncommonly protected. Supernaturally elevated. This month of June, everything that has caused you unrest, I lay them to rest. Whatever has stolen your rest and peace, I command it rest in pieces. You are not a question, you are an answer. Be blessed in Jesus' powerful name. Here are these six things for the month, the Lord has said, and as you receive them, made manifest expressly. Number one, the Lord said, I should tell you, after the order of Psalm 121 verse 8, that it shall preserve your going out and your coming in. Oh, your amen is not like somebody who just heard the word from God. That's the first thing I should tell you. This Psalm 121 verse 8 is a pillar scripture for you. It shall preserve your going out and your coming in. The second thing the Lord said to tell you that in this month of June, it shall be your very present help in time of trouble. After the order of Psalm 46 verse 1, it shall be your very present help in time of trouble. The third thing the Lord said I should tell you after the order of Psalm 68 verse 1, it will arise for you and your enemy shall be scattered. It will arise for you and your enemy shall be scattered. The fourth thing the Lord said I should tell you is after the order of Ezekiel 8 verse 1, he says, the hand of God shall be upon you this sixth month. The hand of God shall be upon you this sixth month. The fifth thing the Lord says I should tell you is after the order of Agai 1 verse 1. You shall hear the voice of God like never before. This month you shall hear the voice of God like never before. The sixth thing the Lord said to tell you, Luke 1 36. He said I should give you this prophetic declaration. That is changing your identity this month. It's changing your identity this month. Now I said that she that was called barren, you that was called poor, you that was called stranded, you that was called idle, you that was called jobless, you that was called childless, you that was called single. God, change your identity this month. In the name of Jesus.